right now we're in the car. We're heading over to Lancaster to check it out. It's supposed to be uh, two hours closer than uh, Salton Sea was. So we're going to go see what the desert looks like out there, what the locations look like, and hopefully bring this thing closer to home. Uh, it just logistically works easier if we're closer to home with travel, with lodging, with all that stuff. It just it works better if we're in an environment where people can come to a set every day and go home every day. Uh, so let's uh, we'll, we'll see what it looks like. So we're in, um, where are we, Palmdale? Palmdale. Palmdale, and we had a pleasant surprise. Uh, Hard Sun takes place in Joshua Tree National Forest, and there's a lot of uh, it plays into the story, so we have to shoot Joshua Trees. But if you look in Palmdale, there's Joshua Trees. Yeah, it's pretty cool too because it's just like right in the middle of, of what seemed to be Palmdale, suburbia Palmdale. It's like BAM! Joshua Tree Forest. Yeah, if you look over here. So check this out. So there's like suburbia right over here. And then on this side, it's like Joshua Tree, Tree Wasteland. We're only five minutes from McDonald's, which is awesome. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. What up? So we just uh, found a house that I believe can be the sheriff's house. It was perfect. It has this garage right out back with, uh, that they can run into, which is what something they do in the script. And it just it looked right in there. These creepy trees. Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys got to check this out. Look at those rocks. It's like another planet. This place is so beautiful. Like, there's so many different things out Joshua here. Joshua Tree there. It's freaking... Oh, that... Oh, oh, oh. Go right over there. Okay. This is my uh, my desert desert gear. Here, I'm over here in a it. hoodie, and this guy's in, like, Siberian weather. I had it all in my trunk. It worked out good. It looks like hands. Yeah, it does. Apparently. So anyway, uh, we're here in Lake Los Angeles, and this is a pretty intense and cool little town. Uh, yeah. No, go ahead. Yeah, I mean this uh, this place would definitely work for for hard sun. It's got everything: the desert, you know, feel the Joshua trees, obviously. Um, all these little houses are are great. They're one-story little little houses. Um, look at these dogs right here. It's chilling. A ton of. Um, yeah, I'm in love with this place. It's definitely a definitely a good find. And what's great again is that it's it feels like it's in the middle of nowhere, but it's not necessarily in the middle of nowhere. I mean, there's. A... Yeah, I mean we're like an hour outside of L.A. here. Like this is not, you know some nowheresville yeah. Nevada this is like you know out outskirts of LA and it looks like this oh, we ran up on this really really creepy barn which looks awesome um, definitely has like a laid-back feel too whereas uh, salt and sea and all that kind of had a creepy hard edge to it um, out here is just much more lax I feel like this property I'd love to go up there yeah I think we just pull over and jump the fence right there here's an opening right here oh here's an opening all right here we go so right now we're pulling up on the exact spot that they filmed Devil's Rejects I am so excited let's this, go let's go stop at the gas station shall we this where, is the gas station where Sherry Zombie the motel. makes the phone call 
right here. Oh, dude, this is the guy. I yep. would love Bill to Bill Mosley was parked station. in the car right across the street there. So check this out. Right here... <laughs> there was a payphone right there. This is the gas station. Right over here... Up, oh, there's the motel. We're going to go over there and check it out. They had to build a billboard right here to hide the motel. <laughs> this is so freaking exciting. Check it out. I'm walking over to the gas station right now. Behind me, there you can see the motel back there. Uh, I'm checking out the gas station for our gas station inside getaway. Just to see if it'll work. And then, you know, if, if not. So, all right. Check this out. gas station look inside fully functional inside that could totally double for other things let's go check around back oh, this go. is so cool look look check this out check this out Let's go check out the motel. Well, we came, we saw, we got kicked out. And there was uh, an old man who was very angry. Very, very angry old man with long white hair. I think he was actually in Devil's Rejects. He might have been. He might have actually been in Devil's Reject. But there, look, look. There it is. Motel. Very exciting. I guess the guy doesn't want business because yeah. he just, you know. <laughs> hey, you. This is private property, you assholes. Get, get the off. fuck out of here. <laughs> Have a nice day. Oh. Fun times. Look at this random trailer out of the middle of nowhere. Think somebody lives there? It's probably the most exciting thing that happened to that guy all day. Yeah. He probably had nothing else going on. Probably didn't help that I had this up like I was going to rob somebody. <laughs> yeah. Well, we've already been kicked out of one Devil's Rejects location today, and we're about to go check out our second one. Uh, so here's hoping we have better luck, I guess. Yeah, Sand Canyon, what ranch we go to? Sable Ranch. Sable Ranch. It's actually the Firefly's home. Um, yeah, the opening scene. In the opening shootout scene. Uh, which, it was recreated out here yeah, because... Yeah. Uh, Sand Canyon. Sand Canyon. Uh, it's recreated out here because uh, Universal didn't want them to come back. So they created it out here and shot it. And so we're going to go check it out, see if we can get in. It might be gated also, but who knows. But uh, all in all, it's been, it's been good. I'm yeah. tired. Good day. Late it's night last time. night. We're shooting uh, something for a pilot last night. It was just really late. It ended up being like... Wrapping at what 5:30 a.m. Yeah, last night. And, I got home at six. Yeah, I got home at six, 6:30 ish, and then back up in the morning to <laughs> 11 o'clock to go scouting again. I'll be up early tomorrow to shoot camera tests. Yeah, and tomorrow's camera test, so that's yeah. another 6 a.m. call. So we'll be shooting uh, so. stuff on the Red MX1 and the Canon 5D with the Zeiss glass. Just checking everything out, seeing how everything holds up. Have some actors with us. I think we might have a helicopter rig coming out, so that'll be cool. We're shooting some promos. So we'll have more footage for you guys later. 